Warning, the following video contains 100% authenticity, facts and logic only, and is toxically masculine. So, if you're easily offended or you don't want to learn something new, then fuck off and go be a pussy somewhere else. Okay guys, so for this video, I just want to talk to you a little bit about, you know, my experience with being bald at 18 years old. I've already been bald for about over a year now, like... A year and around a year and two months almost a year and a month and a half i started shaving my head since i was 17 years old i've been doing it in the summers as well like ever since i was 14 but not with a razor like just with a machine i do it uh once a year in the summer and then i let it grow back but um when i was 17 i was like you know fuck it i'm uh, i'm just gonna do it and i mean as you can clearly see like i still have my hairline right i haven't lost my hair yet you know, I still have hair, I just, I, I choose to shave my head, you know, that's why it's bald, I guess you could say. But, you know, I mean, because, I mean, it's not every day, you know, you see someone who's 18 and, and is bald, right? But here's the thing, um, I'm just going to go on a little bit of a rant, right? Um, When you're young, right, especially as a guy, you don't have much value, you know, I mean, you don't, you know, you don't really have wealth, you don't really have assets, you don't have many things, really, that um <clears throat> that truly determine how successful you are. But your looks, you know, you certainly have that, right? I mean, when you're younger, it's easier to be in shape, you know. Your looks look better. You haven't really aged yet, you know. You haven't aged significantly. You don't look like older guys, you know. So your looks really do play a big part in how valuable you are as a teenager, you know what I'm saying? Like for both men and women. But a lot of guys, you know, I see that they're really obsessed with their hair, you know. Like they're looking in the mirror. They're doing this, you know. They're adding all this product they spend so much money on that, you know, they go to the barber, they get this and that, like, it's crazy to me, because, just, look, what you need to understand is the following, okay, your hair is, is really not important, like, no one really gives a shit about your hair, you know what I mean, like, yeah, sure, I mean, w when I had hair, you know, I like to play with many hairstyles, I like to push it back, I like to push it to the side, you know, that's cool, it looks somewhat good, but it, it means nothing, you know, it's just fucking hair, like, if, if you're too attached with your hair, right, like, that, that that's, that's not good, you know what I mean, like, like, you shouldn't feel like your hair is everything, you know, because as a man, right, being a man is fucking awesome, I mean, when you're, when you're younger, and, you know, you're very low on the scale of worth, then sure, you don't have many things going for yourself, but if you're working on yourself, you know, it's gonna take a couple years, sure, you will get good at many things, you know, you will level up in many ways, you know, so you'll have a lot of value as a man in many ways, right? So when you're a man and you have that opportunity, right, to have value in many ways with, with money, with assets, with women, with all these things, but you're so concerned about your hair, you know, you, you see your hair as a defining trait of yours when you have all these opportunities, it's just foolish of you. It it, it really is. It's it's just foolish of you. No, nobody really gives a shit about your hair, you know what I mean? I mean... You know, being being bald, I'm mean, sure, but I guess I get more attention, I guess you could say in some way. But, you know, it hasn't really changed anything for me. I'm still the same. And the second thing is, I mean, being bald is awesome. You know, um, I'm going to make two more videos. I'm going to make a tutorial on, on how to shave your head and uh, my experience of being bald for a year. Kind of like the pros and cons, I guess you could say. But, I mean, there's really no cons. You know, being bald is awesome. I mean, it. it I take cold showers. I do ice baths. Sometimes it feels amazing, like the feel... You know, when I'm training, when I'm in class, when I'm in the bag, when I'm sparring, the way the sweat goes down, it, it, it feels cool. When I wear a hat, it feels cool. When I lean my head on the pillow at night, it feels cool. Like, it's amazing. You know what I mean? <laughs> Being bald is amazing. So, yeah, I mean, I'm not sure, you know, where I was going with this video. It's not scripted. Like, I mean, none of my videos are scripted. But I just want to kind of go on a little bit of a rant, you know what I'm saying? Like, as a teenager, being 18 years old and being bald, like... You know, it's not a big deal, you know what I mean? You know, your your hair is your hair, you know what I mean? And if you lose it and, and you're lucky to be bald, I mean, because I, I truly think it's something amazing, you know, then just own it, you know what I mean? Don't be one of those guys who, you know, you're losing your hair and you choose to just keep the size on the back. Like, no, you know, own being bald. It's really amazing. And yeah, I mean, kind of a, the underlying message of this video, I guess you could say, I just want to tell you guys, don't feel too attached with anything, you know what I mean? Like, like don't be one of these feminine guys who saw oh, you know my hair my precious hair you know let that be with people let that be with items let that be with anything you encounter or you have in your life don't get too attached you know what i mean be comfortable with letting things go and truly embrace what's important you know what i mean because you know a lot of things you think are important they're not you know they're really not your hair is not fucking important you know 
or working on yourself is trying to get riches you know learning about your body right getting in shape learning about combat trying to improve your game with women if you if you even if you get rejected like you see in these clips up here i got rejected right it's all part of the game right but it's what you need to do to level up and those are the things that are truly important not this fucking shit all right guys so i'll see you next time